My name's Chris Gardner and we're at uh, Mill Farm Ashorn, my family farm. Uh, Mill Farm Ashorn is a family partnership of four of us, myself, my wife and uh, my parents. We're a split business, half agricultural contractors and half equine services. Um, I basically run the agricultural contracting side and my wife runs the equine side. The farm itself is 135 acres, now grass, uh, on which we run all the, the equine business and we produce a certain amount of hay for the equine market. Then we run a series of different agricultural operations from here. Uh, when we started the business we had a, a large JCB fast track and we were looking for a hedge cutter to match that and the one that happened to come up was a second hand um, XL8000. And the reason we went for that was it was piped with extra long pipes to reach the, the cab, obviously with the fast track cab being set so far forward. Uh, we got on very well with that. Um, we cut for two or three years with that as our mainstream hedge cutter. And then when various other contracts came in that required us to get bigger machines, it was the obvious choice to, to continue our relationship with Spearhead. It was the first choice and to be honest, the only choice when it came down to it. We'd been looking at reverse drive for some time, particularly having bought the reverse drive Fent 828 and nobody else seemed to be very interested in working with us to build a reverse drive hedge cutter. Whereas I'd seen footage of uh, a spearhead in the past on a reverse drive uh, Valtra. So I had an, an idea that you, you might be prepared to, uh, to listen to me and uh, go with my crazy ideas. We use the reverse drive in a number of scenarios. Um, very narrow, tight lanes means we can cut almost within the width of the tractor by swinging the arm right behind and the head cuts at the same level as the tractor, if you like. Uh, so if you've got a lane that you can only just fit down with the previous machines, we might have struggled to cut, we might not actually have been able to cut because there just wasn't room for tractor plus head. Whereas with the Flex, we can achieve that, obviously in, in reverse drive. Equally with the quad saw, when we're cutting the bigger branches, in the past with the saw, you had to stand the tractor as far away as you possibly could and just hope that you didn't catch the tractor with the end of the branch or take multiple cuts, which obviously takes time. With the flex, we can cut from behind. We can cut level with the tree, level with the fence line, so we can cut from a, a narrow margin if necessary, but still bring down these bigger branches, which are causing the damage to the combines and the bigger drill tractors and things like that. We're using the spearhead quad saw here on our Flex 890T uh, to push back where a spinny here is encroached into the field. Obviously it's taking up usable ground, uh, means we can get closer with the machines to the edge of the field. Uh, the livestock can graze closer and obviously the uh, grass will grow a little bit better with a bit more sunlight to it. Uh, the material here is a little bit too thick for a flail, so the quad saw really comes into its own. With it fitted to the flex, it gives us fantastic view of the head. We're a good distance away from the material that's coming off. Obviously the blades are spinning at a very high speed and uh, it will have a tendency to throw part of smaller pieces that it's cut quite some distance. Gives us that little bit of safety. Um, from a vision point of view, the head is to our left and slightly forward. Uh, saves me craning my neck round. Uh, saves on dreaded neck ache, um, which is generally the hedge cutter's curse. Um, you just can't beat the flex for visibility. Uh, I would rate it above a VFR machine because it really does reach forward um, and you've still got the flexibility to put it wherever you want. Again we're able to twist the uh, quad saw around using the, the sort of wrist on the end of the machine. It enables us to do a little bit more than with an average hedge cutter. That's one of the benefits of running the flex. We can get the angle just right to make sure we get a clean cut for approaching a bit of material that's uh, not quite in line with the blade, we can tweak the blades a little bit to make sure we get a clean cut each time. Set the machine out a little bit further here, use the telescopic function on the flex, which puts the head again a little bit further forward. Uh, it gives us an opportunity to be able to see just fractionally higher by standing the tractor away um, without compromising anything else. Uh, don't have to be peering out quite so much under, under the cab as you would with a smaller machine. Uh, the fantastic reach on this is very beneficial and it gives us good, good control of what we're doing. Um, with a smaller machine and a smaller tractor, you're very much at the mercy of the elements if you're not careful. The tilt rotator on the machine is, is fantastic. Um, it, it enables us to really get tight around the trees in the hedge lines. Um, we can get rid of a lot more frith that a conventional machine you just physically can't get at. I think overall, from a contractor's point of view, 
the, the name says it all, it's the flexibility of the machine. Um, the fact that we've got the quick hitch on there and the quick couples means we can swap from, from head to saw very quickly. Um, and with Spearhead offering a huge range of attachments, if we decide to put other attachments on the machine, again, we'll be five minutes head to head. Um, and time is always money, so that's very important to us. Um, the machine itself, being able to cut into corners, cut tight spaces, despite it being a big machine, makes it very, very competitive with you know, even smaller machines in tight spaces, but also way out ahead of all the bigger machines. Um, there's not much on the market to touch it at the moment, I don't think. Our local spearhead dealer is Lister Wilder uh, at Southam, that's their northerly branch, and they've been very good. They've helped us in working with ourselves and Spearhead. The three, the three companies have worked very well together, and we've ended up with the product you see behind me. Um, and yeah, it's been a, a very, very smooth course, to be quite honest with you. It's a complicated machine. There were always going to be a few, few niggles here and there, and to be honest, it hasn't interrupted our business at all. We've been able to, to crack on. Even when we've had problems, they've been sorted very efficiently through both Listers and, and Spearhead. And uh, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm very, very happy with the, the three-way relationship we've got going there. It's, uh, it's been very good for us. Thank you.